Sitting in a helicopter with a funeral director isn't where everyone finds themselves on a weekday afternoon. But when I learned of East Coast Memorial's new and unique sky scattering service, I had to know more. My name is Katie Jean, I'm from Nova Scotia, and this place has everything. A few months ago, while doing a regular doom scroll of Facebook, an ad caught my eye of a helicopter. While scrolling past, my brain clicked that the helicopter ad had something to do with a funeral home. I discovered that a funeral home was offering a sky scattering service, and surprised to find out it was being offered right here in Nova Scotia. I emailed funeral director Andrew George, who trumped my tell me mores with offering to show me how sky scattering worked. We boarded the helicopter close to the Halifax airport and headed out to Sambro Island. The flight was nothing new to George who grew up around aviation. Hovering in the helicopter, George asked if I was ready to see how sky scattering worked. George showed me the instrument that would be used in the sky scattering, a small metal box attached to the controls inside the helicopter. He loaded the box with sand and lowered it down a hatch of the helicopter. Seated in the front, you could see in a camera the box being lowered. George handed me a small remote with a red button on top. That would be used to release the contents of the box. I counted down, trying to think of how it would feel if it were a real experience. After reaching one, I clicked the most defining of clicks. The sand was visible as a cloud and then dissipated, from existing as one to existing as everything in an instant. It was profound. We then landed on Sambro Island and took time to take a stroll around the tiny silent island. Less than an hour later, we were back in the helicopter heading home and discussing the service. It is a jarring thing to read about and the last thing you want to think about, but it really was a moving experience. You can find out more at eastcoastmemorial.ca.